All right, I'm at Compass Point Marina, St. Thomas, U.S. Virgin Islands, and we are showing Lucky. Lucky was unlucky one day. Hurricane Irma, 2017, was damaged. And I have lots of customers asking me what the damages are. There is no engines on the boat. Well, they were pulled because they were flooded and no good. Okay, so you see the engine room can be cleaned a little better. Still got the sail drive. They're SD60s on here. The rudders, posts around but need repair. These plastic line holders need to be resealed. One over there and we need one, it's missing. Okay. A couple of these poles need to be replaced. We do have a couple of the extra ones in the shop that we got from another Lagoon 450. So this pole, that pole. We have this hatch. So the console is put inside so it wouldn't blow away for storms. We do have a set of these if someone wants them, windless that we, or winches that we could sell with the boat or separately. See, it needs trampolines, stanchions, push pits, pole pits. It's got a windlass on board. It's got the furler. I think the furler needs some love. But it's there. It's got an anchor. It's got a nice park job. This is what you're looking at as a free storage. So if someone wants to get over here and start working on this bad boy, they are not getting charged where the boat's sitting. And it's tucked in nicely for any weather that comes our way in the dead mangroves. So it's got fenders. The owner has actually put another generator in. So comes with another generator. Of course it needs a mast, but the mast plate is good still. Some of the solar panels work, but you can tell the ones that don't. All right, well, let me take you inside. It's got a hot patch on the back. Same with the starboard side. It'll open up that engine room after. Nice teak floor cockpit, looks still good. The table's put inside. We threw a bunch of stuff inside so that didn't get taken or blow away for the storm. Tables like that. There's the helm station. Needs most of the electronics. So it still needs a lot of cleaning. This 
See some of the panels. This is a project boat for someone. But if they're handy and want to do all the work, they got a good spot for a condo. I am going to take a bunch of pictures, put it up online. If you did put it back on dock, you can plug it in and use it on shore power. The forward air conditioner, those batteries are good. They work. Battery charger works. Some electrical works. So it has been having the electrical being worked on. Uh, the forward AC works. It's okay, Jonas. All right, well, that's it. This is lucky. We do have another one of these Davits at our shop. This engine room keeps getting water in it. It's parked nicely on a boat. And not much water, but you can see it's been hot patched and does need some reshaping on the starboard engine. And these, this solar panel has been hooked up to run a charge. All right, well, that's it. Thanks for tuning in. So again, you can reach out to Chad Blake at Harbor Shoppers in St. Thomas, U.S. Virgin Islands. And I'll be happy to give you more information about the current status of Lucky. And you want a project boat with free storage? We got one for you and you work at it at your own pace. Put yourself maybe on a water maker, some more solar, use your generator, get yourself a little dinghy to get back and forth, and build yourself a condo. At Harbor Shoppers in St. Thomas, and this could be your daily view.